thing. It doesn't light up like a pink ring like yours. My Mine is dropping. It's so big. That was a very professional. <laughs> hmm? You've never asked a guy for his number? I haven't either. I just ignore them and I'm like, eh, what? Oh, I have to use the bathroom. I'm let it snow. Let it snow. This is why we can't get any work done in the morning. No, <laughs> oh, babies. Did you chase that male woman off? Yeah. Yeah, you showed her. Uh -huh. What's she doing on our turf? Yeah, bring <laughs> packages and stuff. That's just you trying. You try. There's one spot left. She's like, I'm going to make it. Oh, my God. Oh my I'm going to make it. <laughs> oh, my gosh. They love the sunlight too. <laughs> Holy shit. Did you take uh, please tell me you got this in the picture? <laughs> I did. You're like a grandma and her grandchildren. Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle bell, rock. Jingle bell swing and jingle bells ring. Snowing and blowing, I do you the fun. Hmm? I didn't even know turkeys can be cute. But look at that. <laughs> They're good. I've had them. They're really good. I'm thinking can we get the thing of macarons? Guinness! My baby. You had a little mishap. Guinness puke. Everywhere. Guinness had a little throw up session. <laughs> At least he didn't pee because one like Yeah, he, he got car out. sick. <laughs> That's why you travel with a roll of paper towels. Works. Have some tomato, tomato. <laughs> I have some tomato basil soup and grilled cheese. She got some soup and a chicken pot pie that is amazing. Yeah. Kind of already ate a bunch of our sweets. Like, mm -hmm. look at that. <laughs> they were really, really good. And we have no self control. No self control. <laughs> I love this place. It's so pretty. I love how they have a little dog with them. I've actually never seen that. Yeah. But where's his life jacket? That's what I was saying. Yeah. He probably is a good swimmer. We just finished our food. We're gonna go get some hot tea now. Maybe I'll get hot chocolate. Yes. Hot chocolate's, it's like perfect for hot chocolate too. Sounds pretty really good. Mm. <laughs> Is that yeah. I think it's because we're here. People are just kind of out in the open. Sure. Yeah. I need some coffee. Mm -hmm. I'm a little swing. A little dog with a sweater. We're recording. Yeah. We're gonna concentrate on driving. Yes. So we ran to the house. Um, I don't think I I was driving. God, ew! I look like a potato. No, you don't. 
stop. Can you just record your stuff? No, no, no. <laughs> I can't drive. No, no, you're fine. You're fine. So I was drying my hair like a mad woman. We both like washed our hair in five minutes. Five minutes. We got ready in 20 minutes flat, pretty much, right? Yeah. It never happens. Never. That, that, like, hell With just washed hair, over. makeup, yeah. make, makeup redo, not like makeup. Touch up. I didn't do my eyes or anything. I did. But she I doesn't just, need to. Look at that. She got like it cat just eyeliner. Tiny, but it's so tiny. It she looks, looks like she just walked off of Chanel runway. <laughs> okay. Flattered. Yeah. <laughs> Chanel runway, like vampy lip. Clean that's, skin. See, that's a trick. When you have very minimal yeah. eye makeup, but you want to look Slap really done. some dark lipstick on. Dark. I was going for, first I put a natural one, and I was like, because I'm wearing all black. And then black. I was like, I want to do a dark, like, bold, bold lip. So and it works. Bold one. I'm trying to fix my works. hair. So my hair is half wet. So what I did was I, I rolled it up in the car, like, right now in a bun. And it looks so nice. Like, such an ugly angle. The it's not. <laughs> I mean, it, it's, it's your car's windows over here. Look at that. I know. That looks. <laughs> yeah. No. My baby little. Eyeballs. So yeah, we uh blocked the driveway, so her mom and her husband had to wait for us to get out of the house to to move the car. Oh, yeah. So that was fun. Kind of pissed everybody off in the process, but it was worth it. Oh yeah, we're going to see a drag show. Yeah. I messed up my bottom lip. Stop messing with it. <laughs> the bottom part Nothing of my wrong lip with thing, your... it like, it peeled off yesterday. It's fine. <laughs> it's gonna be dark in there and... No, I'll fix it when I get there. I don't care if people watch me or not. Yeah. I don't care about that. So... <laughs> yep. So, um... We're gonna um, watch... We're going to Lips at Atlanta. It's a drag show and dinner type thing. Never gone before, so we just figured, like, why not go now? It'll I be fun. we've been to a drag show before, didn't we? I've never you been have never been to a drag show. Ooh, you're gonna like it. It's awesome. All right. I'm just there for the food. And boobs. <laughs> well, you're driving, so I'm there for the booze. Yeah. I'll have like, maybe a martini when I go, but that's really good. So. Yeah. And yep. the show is like two hours long, but we might not make it to the show because we're getting there right as the show starts, but we don't they might know. be really strict because they were like, be here by 9.30. And there's no way in hell we're going to make it to We will not make it by 9.30. We have four minutes left and it takes 19 more minutes to get there. We live like an hour away, okay? Like, we're going to get there right at 9.45 where show starts. Like exactly. So I don't even know if they'll let us in though. Like we reserved everything. But we don't know. And if nothing mile, else, keep we're going to go tomorrow. We're already in Atlanta. Oh my God. Oh racing. my God. I want my car right now. I'd be, yeah. I don't see you racing, sorry. I've done it. It's nice. Yeah, well, I've done it too, and I've beaten cars with my tiny ass Audi. Well, tiny ass Audi weighs to half as much as my car does. What do you mean, weighs? Weighs. Weighs? My, oh. Yeah, my car is very heavy. So, might still beat it. Bye. <laughs> um, we might test that theory out. Bye. Vroom, vroom. Toot, toot. Mm -hmm. <laughs>
full martini Yeah, like we still have a full martini left. Come on. And our waitress was the prettiest one. And it was funny, like I while we were waiting, I was like, that waitress has the prettiest hair. And guess what? I got her as the waitress. And she was so sweet and so pretty. The whole show was awesome. So y'all need to come check out Lips Atlanta. It's really good. So fun. I love things. It's like a karaoke slash comedy show. Yeah. You know? Yeah. And that's your way to He was gorgeous. Gorgeous. <laughs> Question. What setting powder do you use? I love a matte look. So, secrets of drag queen. A beautiful drag queen like that. Yeah. Um, Ben Nye all the way. Three Ben Nye. Uh, foundation. Just to get the right color. No, she and said then, she mixes powder. She doesn't mix powder. And then, no, she said she uses all Ben Nye. And then Ben Nye powder. She uses banana powder, topaz, and banana shimmer.
We made it back home and we decided it's time to put on onesies. Struggle is real. <laughs> oh! Diesel. It's Diesel. Oh, you're pulling my hair, guys. Wow. <laughs> wow, wow. <laughs> hey, boo boos. Hey, boo boos. I got two onesies today, and this one feels a little tight. Not that it's like tight, tight, but I like it to be like really baggy when I'm sitting down or walking around. But the other one is a deer, so it's like perfect. There's no music playing. What are you doing? What are you doing? So, yeah. Oh, yeah, these are unicorns. Four. You know what I do with my unicorn? Sometimes I just want to stab people. <laughs> Hold on. Do you? Lightly. <laughs> Sword fight. Corn is crooked. <laughs> Kids plan this ahead of time because we both went <laughs> right into each other's <laughs> Broke my horn. Guinness, I love you. I love you, Guinness. Guinness wants nothing to do with this. Yes, thank you. <laughs> love you, Guinness. Mm. What is happening? By the way, this lip stain has stayed on like a really long time it's working good job Maybelline buenos noches since yo soy mexicano pearl hmm you've never asked the guy for his number I haven't either I just ignore them and I'm like eh, what I have to, oh, I have to use the bathroom I'm so awkward what was the weirdest way someone asked you out or for your number? I honestly thought this guy was trying to steal my purse. <laughs> and what did he do? He just kind of took it and tried to walk away with it. He like, was trying to steal it then. He was trying to get me to follow him like, you bitch. No, he was trying to steal it. So when you caught him, he was like, oh girl, I just wanted your number. I don't know. It was really strange. Think about it. He would have walked away if he didn't really notice. I don't know. I'd probably run faster than him. <laughs> Could be. Do you like to run? No. <laughs> the weirdest way anyone has ever asked for my number is... I can't remember a time no one asks for my number. <laughs> Love. Will you call me if I give you my number? Will you call me if I give you my number? <laughs> no. I don't know. Like, no one ever asks me for my number. And where no one ever really asked me out, but then I'm also like very naive to like You've been also married five years. I've also been married five years, almost seven. No, I mean how did it go from five to seven? Yeah. Almost six. I'm married or not, even before that, I just didn't Well, you've been always in a relationship. If someone liked me though, I didn't know because I like people as friends. Does that make sense? Yeah, yeah like yeah. most likely people don't tell me because like once they become my friends they, they know that I like have a boyfriend or like a husband. So like Surprise, thank you. Yeah. And the ones that do push further than that, like I don't become friends with them. I get, like I'm not gonna stay friends with somebody and tag them along. People who can stay friends with me, I stay friends with. Mm -hmm. Like people who are also like okay. Some people can't. Boys are weak. They're fucking weak. Sometimes you can wrap them around your finger, but that doesn't mean you should. Yeah. Because people will get crushes on you, okay? Oh, yeah. When you work with somebody, people will get crushes on you, but it's up to you to not act on it. Like, you should be the bigger person. You're the one in the relationship. You're the one doing the wrong. Even if the other person is, you're the one responsible for your own relationship. You should be yeah. like, no. Or you just... If you want to stay friends with them, though, like, just don't push it. Don't get that out of them, like, oh, you used to like me. Like, don't, don't, 
don't play with that shit. It's past 3 a.m. So I'm really tired. Well, good night, you guys. Good night.